Hey guys, I'm here. Welcome back. Last time we finished Cyclamen Road, got the badge from Watson, and we're just gonna keep on trucking. Got something in Fiery Path, and just, yeah, just gonna go from there. I do not have as much time to record today. Um, got a later start than I wanted, like, a lot later, so I, I don't know how much I'll be able to get done, unfortunately. I kind of got busy this evening, and then forgot to record, basically, but I want to put something out there for two reasons. One, just get something out uh, at the middle of the week is a good way to, to remind myself to, you know, get something done. And two, because I want to talk about, uh, oh, I don't have my HM guy with me right now, do I? I think I've put Suijin in the box for Mary or whatever and in the Dust Clops. Um, I believe I did. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I'm smart. Except not really. Alright. Yeah, okay, rule. Okay. Anyway, the thing I want to talk about is that um, I am planning a stream this weekend. I'm going to do a sort of Pokemon challenge run. Um, there's a bunch of rules I'm still bouncing around, but you, you get the kind of... You know what I mean when I say a challenge run, you know. Certain limitations, what things you can do, what Pokemon you can use, that kind of stuff. Plenty of YouTubers do it. There's a very good chance you've seen one before. If you watch any kind of Pokemon content at all, it's actually pretty popular these days. But anyway, uh, the main rules I'm going to be setting in are... God, there's a couple of them that I don't like have them on hand, so give me a bit to recall them. I'm going to go ahead and grab these berries real quick, though. So, the first rule, and I'll just try and bolt them off as I go, because uh, I can't remember them all off the top of my head. They're still kind of floaty. Still working everything out, even just what game I'm going to do it on. But first rule is, I am limited to three Pokemon. On its own, that's not kind of, not much of a constraint. You can win most Pokemon games with one easy. But once I had, once we had a couple others that are coming up, it kind of becomes... It's not, it, it's not an insanely difficult challenge, but it has a bit of... Here's a front has a bit of difficulty to it. So yeah, the first rule is that, is the, uh, back, 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 back. What do you got for me? Oh, when you catch a Pokemon here too. Uh, second rule is, I have a level cap. I cannot take my Pokemon higher than the highest level Pokemon of whatever gym I'm going to next. So, in the early game, yeah, that's not going to be a bit too much of a problem. And this applies to the Elite Four, too. Oh, we use Poison Powder. Sorry, I'm, my, my eyes are darting all over the place. I'm only kind of half paying attention right now because I'm not really worried about Skip Blue. So, yeah, let's see. So, three Pokemon level cap. Uh, what was the next one? Right. Um, so, the next rule is um, I can only use Pokemon Centers and free heals once. And that means, by once I mean like per town. Every town, you know, I can only use its Pokemon Center once. I could do the whole thing of, you know, only items, and I probably could. But I want to make it, you know, not completely crazy. Like, I want to be able to have some fun with it, because I'm going to do it in a stream format. Don't, not gonna, this is going to be like some meticulously routed thing. It's going to be kind of a fun on the side you know, kind of tough, but not too tough. Not too insanely tough challenge run. Oh, there was another rule. Uh, what was it? No, I might want to consider switching out. Not because I'm worried about Sunkern. Oh, no, the mighty Sunkern. <laughs> no, because I'm not just the poison. Ah, uh, God. Give me a second. I'm trying to remember what the other rule was. Uh, what was it? Three Pokemon level cap. Limited healing. That's what it was. That was what. okay. So I can, and then last, and then the last major rule. There's like a couple of other side rules I think I'm getting. 
I've got it listed uh, elsewhere, so when I finally put this together for the stream, I'll know what I'm doing. I'll know what I'm doing then. But right now, it's all kind of up in the air. Especially in my head. Floating in the clouds! But the rule is, um, I have to, all the Pokemon I use have to have naturally learned moves. I can't use TMs or HMs as far as combat goes. The HMs themselves, I'm kind of debating a rule whether um, I'll just use HM slaves or make some sort of exception. Probably the former. But, yeah, so. Naturally learned moves only. Three Pokemon to the team. Level cap based on where I am in the game. And limited uses of Pokemon centers. And those are the four major rules of the challenge run that I'm going to do. Probably this Saturday. Uh, I'm still trying to... I'm still up in the air if I'll do this on Wednesday. Or, uh, no, not Wednesday. Today's Wednesday. Um, Saturday or Sunday? I'm planning to put out another video on Friday, and I'll have worked out all the details by then. So we can just go from there. Hey, Torkoal. Uh, yeah. yeah, you could stay in. You could probably handle this. Fire spin, nice. That did a decent bit. Oh, it was a crit, okay. I can't see that. was just fire spin. Torkoal's doing that much with fire spin, I, I've got reason for concern. Yeah, missed. Torkoal's my favorite fire Pokemon. Especially pure, pure fire. Mixed maybe has a couple of contenders. Can't really think of any off the top of my head. But, yeah, I like Torkoal. I like a lot of Gen 3 Pokemon a lot. Oh, yeah, Yen, though. Uh, it's probably going to be doing double team things. Uh, let's just have Moltres kill it before he can do that. Wing attack. and go catch something. Good old Thunder Wave. Well, speaking of HM Pokemon, Suijin might be pretty good to turn into our HM guy. Because it's already got Rock Smash and other Dust Clops. That is a... What route are we on, actually? Hold on. We're gonna... Duck back into Fiery Cave for a second here. Shoop. This counts as 112. Where did we get Mary? 112. Okay. We can't catch. Never made. Same round. Got a new member from the team who isn't even fully trained yet. <laughs> what do you got for me? Tangela? Yeah, you can fight it. No, you can't fight it. <laughs> Let's get you out of there. Let's see. Yeah, just Moltres. Just, just legendary Pokemon things. sense. I don't have as much time tonight. Since we got a late start on this. I'll probably probably just go till I get to Follower. Or I guess I don't know. If it I, I've always said it as Follower, like with soft R's. Like Follower. Kinda like that. But I've everyone else always has said fall fall arbor, at least from people I've talked to about it. And it just feels wrong to me. 
Not because because they're they're probably right. And when you look at the oh come on, Joe. or Joe. Because when you look at how it's written and how it reads, it's probably you know it probably is Ar Ball Arbor. So that makes sense. That just makes sense. But considering when I played this and my vast uh, knowledge of the English language at the time, I probably butchered it and I said it like that for you know over a decade now. <laughs> It's kind of hard to break that habit. So I'll always say kind of like follow more. Like, you know, it's like the end is kind of just blah, 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 together. It's probably much sharper. Much more distinct on how you're supposed to say it. But not me. I'm lazy. Level up. Sharpedo. I'd like to get a Sharpedo on the team. Those are fun to use. Uh, yeah, by the way. Sharpedo should not be too scary. It's such a cool model. Like, actually, Sharpedo is one of the coolest models. Especially in its sprite versions. You know, 3D models aren't as cool, like, you know, they kind of lose some of the flair, if you ask me. But, especially this, uh, sprite model for Sharpedo, it's just really cool. If it behooves me. Oh, eloquent. Unlike me! Let's get secret power. Oh, whoops. My favorite place to make the secret base was always, bleh, was always the little shrubs. I feel like those had the best look to them. Some of the caves were nice, but it's like, some of them are intentionally designed to be just ugly. It's just like, why would you do that? Yeah, let's heal up here. Oh yeah, I don't know if I mentioned it, um, but for the stream, free heals and special heals like that fall under the same rule. That I can, you know, only use them that one time and then they're gone. Turn! Turn! Game was not receiving my inputs. I was pressing right and I had let go of down, and it was not taking. catch something in the ashy area after we fight you we are not actors I'm, I thought about like very loosely thought about pursuing acting in high school I did take one acting class in college well I guess it wasn't Acting was more of theater of history, or theater of history, no, switch those words. History of theater. This is a fun class. But it's never something I pursued or pursued super actively. Probably for the better that way. Don't think I could have pulled it off. I actually started wanting to learn computer science, and coding, and that kind of stuff. About two classes into that path, once I, you know, actually taken out some of the prerequisites and started doing. Oh no. We 
be good. Be good. We not good. We not good. Abort! We're getting Moltres out here right now. <laughs> Sui Jin repays tenfold. Oh! I can't rule in the wings in case something happened to you. But I was not ready for the first one, first death to be just from a hey magnitude ten against a random trainer. Thank you for being bulky. What was I saying? I something about classes. Right, right, right. So when I started college, I wanted to learn computer science. I taken a couple of. Oh wait, wrong move. You know what? Nah, it's not even worth Giga Drain's not gonna do enough. Uh eh, just Moltres. Anyway, yeah, so it took about two, maybe three, I forget it was long. It was several years ago at this point. For me, which for me feels like a long time because now I've you know, I'm basically done. Might go back at some point, but that'll be later in my life. I'm I'm good with what I have right now. Taking my first steps towards careers and that kind of stuff. I, I, I'm in a good. I'm in a pretty good place post college. But anyway, I st when I started, I wanted to. So yeah, I took a couple of computer science classes, and I quickly realized that coding, that kind of stuff, just was not up my alley. I really wanted to. I th I thought it was the coolest, like coolest thing you could do. And then once I started doing it, I just it's not. I could not wrap my head around it. Maybe it was a bad teacher, maybe it was some... I just didn't have the aptitude for it, I don't know. But I quickly swapped to, um, you know, climate, climatology and geography systems and that kind of stuff, which kind of uses some computer science stuff, but in a different vein. Basically, I like using computers, but I have no idea what I'm doing when it comes to coding itself. That's not my department. I've learned a little bit, I had to, for um, my degree, but even then, that that class was painful. I was racking my brain, and it's not even that hard of a class, it's a pretty simple coding class. It's just some pretty basic Python stuff, and I was racking my brain in that class. A Gligar, huh? Yeah, okay. You're gonna be kinda tough to catch, aren't you? I can't paralyze you. Get a sting. But yeah, just coding's not for me, so I I took the hint after those first few classes. Realized this isn't for me, this isn't gonna work out. And maybe if I stuck with it, things could have changed. But I, I feel like I made the right No! Did it survive? Well, but yeah, I just determined early on that wasn't the path for me, and I think it was the right choice. Yeah, we'll use a paper. I wanted to be, I wanted to be cheeky about it. And I've been so distracted, I haven't thought of names. And you know me, if I don't come up with a name in the first 20 seconds, we're staring at a screen until I just blurt out a name. No sense. All right, the Ligar. What to call you? Fly scorpion. Grab glides without making a single sound. Grabs. Except it's supposed to be time. You know what? We're just gonna call him Scorpion. I'll have to check how much HP he had left. Oh yeah, and I guess, um, just because I'm kind of laying out some of the ground rules for the stream here, and I just, things pop into my head when I'm talking. I'm a very scared brain person, and I jump all around the place. Keeping up with 
my thought, uh, train of thought isn't easy, because I am a scatterbrain. Anyway, I can't PC scum to heal. That's basically what I was alluding to. I went on a whole tangent just for that. Aren't I great? He to he second handle this with Nightshade, no problem. Yeah, yeah. What I want is to get something like Poison Jab. Because then Hidehise will be an actually pretty good Poison type. And I don't know if it has in this in this gen, but there's moves like Sticky Web, and I don't remember when that was introduced. It probably isn't even a Gen 3 move, it's probably later, if I'm being honest. But either way, Ariados will have some utility. And, you know, Poison type. And yeah, that kind of has some overlap with uh, Kingpin, but you know what? Oh, I didn't mean to jump. No, I wanted the hidden item. Oh, well, it's fine. Ooh, a Sunstone. Nice. We'll fight them. Let's see, who do I want? Yeah, we'll put Mary back in front. Still needs to level a bit to catch up with the others. Violet is pulling ahead again because of all the support she puts into the team. Yes. Dustclops can handle this. Confusion. Love the tankiness of Dustclops. Oh, it's withdrawn. Small while, huh? That typing's not gonna help you. That's what I like about the AI in Emerald. And I don't know if it was that this good in, in Ruby and Sapphire either, because um just because it's been so long since I played those particular ones. I've always played Emerald, but anyway, the AI in this is actually sufficiently smart. They act like regular trainers will do things you normally don't expect them to do. You know, normally you think you just bulldoze your way through them. But they actually do some pretty smart moves in this game. And the fact that they can adapt even in being randomized is really nice. Because it means it's like actively checking the, for those like, you know, presets and advantages and stuff like that. And like, you know, yeah, it's way, probably way easier from a coding perspective to, even though I just finished talking about how I don't know shit about that stuff. But anyway, to like code like a one set of rules for a trainer and then up and down and like, you know, a couple presets as to each battle, as opposed to like coding each battle with these type of condi certain type of checks, basically. No, Moltres. But I just think it's cool that the AI is pretty adaptable, especially for Gen 3. Alright, good job, Moltres. Twenty-three. Confused right, that's nice. I'm not gonna say no to that. Let's get rid of Astonish. It's not really a useful move. Let's see, we're coming up on 30 minutes here. Yeah, I think we'll stick with the original plan. I'll wake make my way into Fall Apart. And then Uh Catch the Pokemon on the other side. Oh, a Meganium. That would have been cool. We missed a Chikorita earlier on. Let's get out of here. I probably wouldn't have used a Meganium. Just being realistic. But it also would have been cool to have, like, a second of the Johto starters. <laughs> Imagine if by the end of it we had a Typhlosion, Meganium, and for Alligator. That'd be crazy. Meganium's no, no, thank you, but I'm good to go. Meganium's not exactly bad, but it also doesn't really stand out, at least in my mind. As far as its combat abilities, if you like Pokemon, you like it. 
I like Torkoal for crying out loud. Competitively, it's probably... Is, especially earlier on, it's pretty use It was pretty bad. I don't know how it's doing these days with the drought buff and all the other things it's gotten over the past few gens. Pichu! Would have been nice to have a Raichu. You little rat! We got paralyzed, heal stuff. Double battle up there. Da -da -da. Cherry berries, there they are. No, I don't want to look at the tag. I want to heal my Pokemon. Fight me! Who's in my second slot? Shouldn't matter, but who is there? I don't know. Guess we'll find out. Beebass and Charizard. The dynamic duo. We may want to get Hidekisei out of there. It is a Charizard. Yeah, Ultras can do this. Powerful. Beyond belief. Ugh, my, my throat's getting dry. No, I don't have water with me. Oh, what am I doing? Stay hydrated, people. Especially if you're going to be talking for any sort of extended period. Gathering is probably one of the weirdest mechanics I've ever seen in Pokemon, if I'm being honest. Magma. There's a lot of cool Pokemon that were in here. It's kind of fortunate we got stuck with just Gligar. Especially because there's not even Gliscor yet. If, if Gliscor were in the game, I'd be singing a different tune. But, you know, it's not, so... It's kind of unfortunate. White Flute? Okay. Plenty of other things that we've run into on this route that I would not mind having. We're not even going to bother with the... Uh, uh, soot and sack or whatever it's called, you know, the Ash Gathering mini-game, basically. Polyrat, who's up front? You are. You can handle this, no problem. I should probably take the XP share off you. Ha-ha! <laughs> cannot hurt me. I feel like I, uh, I'm feeling like I forgot to say something at some, at some point, and I have no idea when, so now it's just nagging at the back of my head. I'm pretty sure I talked about all the stream stuff. I know I did. I covered all the bases on that. If I missed something, it would be way. Man, this is... I, I, I'm a scatterbrain, but I don't like being it because I run into crap like this. And then I'm sitting here like, what, what am I forgetting? I don't know. I don't know. Knocked out. Flat. So yeah, um, we're coming up to what I'm going to call time. It is a lot shorter than my usual stuff. But like I said, I got a late start on this. I... Oh, hey, Kabuto. There you are. So yeah, we'll go heal up. We'll check what Scorpion has as its most inability. We'll go catch something on the other side of the route and call it there. Giga Drain should... <coughs> Excuse me. Try to handle this no problem. Water with me next time. It's 
Especially if I'm going to be doing the stream. Don't forget my stinking water. Wrong buttons. Wrong buttons. Alright, let's take off the XP share because we are getting a little ahead of the team. We don't need that. What's this? Safeguard. Not the worst move to find. We'll fight these guys another day. We'll fight them on Fab Mail. So fabulous. Oh, you weren't even facing me. I call hacks. Oh, God, my throat is so freaking dry. It's killing me. Nito King, how much health does Mary have? You can handle this. Yeah. <laughs> it's getting worse by the second. Like, it's at that turn... Oh, poison. It's at that turning point where it's like, you need to stop and go get some water. But I gotta wrap up! Like, let's get a move on! At least it's not toxic poison. We'll swap Mary out after it takes down the Nido King. But you've pulled ahead of the pack very quickly. Let's see, a Marowak will have... Sujin fight. Might be your last. Because pretty soon I'm thinking you're going to turn into our HM Pokemon. She didn't do anything wrong. In fact, she's done well. But she's probably also able to learn a lot of those moves. Rock Smash probably can learn Surf and Dive. I'm pretty sure they can. I know Polyrath can learn Surf. I'm not certain on Dive. Might not be able to. Should be. And then I can probably learn Strength. And that's like 90% of what I need. Because I don't really need Flash anymore. And I can put that. And Bible has that. Let's go heal. Go check out what Scorpion has. All oh, right, Scorpion's health will heal. We can't check what it has. Ah, well, that sucks. It was probably like just one though. No more than three. <laughs> yes. Just so hot this summer, man. It has been nuts. All right, what do you got? I got a final alternative that sometimes it just interferes with Mike. Very, very standard set. Scorpion's probably not getting you. So I'm gonna be real. Can't even get to the Gliscor. It doesn't have egg scissor. The stuff that makes Gligar food isn't there yet, basically. Which is a shame because I really like Gliscor. Do not get me wrong. I think post Gen 4, Gligar is a really cool Pokemon. Just before then, it's kind of lacking. Let's see if we can pick up some Pokeballs, actually. What route is this? 114? Yes, good. Can't get anything new yet, but we might as well pick up some more. Go ahead and get even 20, because I like even numbers. I like stacks of 10. Alright, get the thing, Twisted Spoon, that's not a bad find at all. No! I don't want to fight you, I just want to finish. But I need to end it on the note I said I would. Scyther, nice. Not nice enough. I will zap you. My quality is dropping by the minute. 
Salamence. Yikes. I would be scared of that. But we got a Dusk Cops. Plus, we're not at a level where we know anything crazy yet. We're getting up there, though. Things are going to start ramping up pretty soon here. Oh, didn't think of that. We'll swap out because of crit might be bad. Yeah, let's go to Moltres. I should have just ended when we got to fall aboard. Because it's just, it's just falling apart now. Yes! Alright, let's put Byleth up front. And let's, let's just finish. <laughs> let's just finish this. Byleth's already up front. I know what I'm talking about. Alright, give us something good to wrap up the evening. What do we got? I will take a ball toy. I am okay. Didn't know it yet. Pointing out those clops, just be safe. Wary of exploding. I don't think Ball Toy would have it yet, but I also don't really know when Ball Toy would get it. Or should be able to handle this, no problem, though. So we'll just use Nightshade and then throw a great ball. Plus, being a ghost, you know, it's safe from self destruct. Also, there's some crazy ability. Freaking Mold Breaker. The chances of that would be very, <laughs> very unfortunate, let's just say that. check its ability, and then we'll call it. One last run to the finish for today. And yeah, I'll probably post again on Friday. I plan to. Barring something getting in the way, there will be another uh, main length episode on Friday. And I'll lock in the time and all the details for the stream at that point, too. So, good, good talk, guys. <laughs> no, no. Oh man, I'm tired. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Let's see. Okay, that's not bad. And... Alright, yep. Well, that's all for me. I'll catch you later.